Hey, I'm Trey Nelms, Nashville Fire Rescue Company 12. Today, we're gonna to talk about gaining initial access for your tools or a purchase point in an extrication setting. Of course, there are several things that you're gonna to have to have in place before we start bending metal. One, you're gonna to have to have vehicle stabilization with cribbing in place. Of course, you're also gonna to have to address needs of the patient. So we're gonna ensure that we have hard and soft protection in place to make sure that things are gonna be safe for our patient. Breaking glass, breaking glass. And we also need to ensure that we de-energize the vehicle, especially with the car technology that we're dealing with today. Of course, we're gonna try before we pry, but now we have to have a way to put our tools in, initial access, a purchase point. There's a variety of different ways, and we're gonna show you several. The first, we're gonna use hand tools, a basic ax and halligan. So these guys can come in, use this, and we'll gain an access point for our tools. Justin's gonna position his halligan. Baker will give him a tap or two. And once it's in place, Justin will just pivot down and get an initial access point for our spreaders. If he needed to, he could just keep going and expand it by just walking it down. All right, you saw the technique Justin demonstrated with the hand tools. Here's a hydraulic method. Scott's gonna pinch and it's gonna gap this door open here. So you can see right here, just by coming in and squeezing, Scott opened that up. Here's another technique, he's pinched. He's gonna just walk this around like a can opener now to give him even more access. We've showed you the nader side, but if you have to make access to the hinge side, here's a technique. You can see just by doing a little sheet metal work here by crushing the fender, then exposing, we've got a clear shot at both the hinges and the wire harness. I'm gonna show you one more technique with the hydraulics. We like to call it the vertical crush. It is awesome if you have a side impact collision or you need something to pull the door away from the patient. We like to put it just about like this. and get it in position. You see that the tool's holding its own weight, but see how the position of the arms are. What this is gonna allow us to do is to push this door out and away from the patient, and it's gonna gap open on both sides, the hinge side and the nader side. So we got a pretty good gap here if we needed one, and we got one going on up front as well. Since we're talking purchase points, here's a trick of the trade for a car fire. All of us have made a vehicle fire where the cables burn through and it's hard to gain initial access to the hood. These guys are just gonna use basic hand tools for access. Watch how he's using the ax instead of the halligan for his prying tool, yep. and the halligan is yep. the striking yep. tool. By using the ax, you can see we use this technique to get a quick knockdown until we can gain full access. We showed you a variety of ways to gain initial access or purchase points. There are several out there, but these are just some that have worked for us over the years. We hope you saw something that worked best for your situation or for the patient. Train like your life depends on it, because for them, it does. Breaking glass.